Hey YouTube, this is The Art of Prepping. Thanks for joining me on Prepper Health Saturday. So what kind of uh, micronutrients do you need to supplement with uh, when you're under high stress? It could be a survival situation or it could be during uh, just a, a personal type of uh, crisis. Maybe you lost your job and you don't want to lose your home. And so you're trying to do uh, extraordinary measures to keep your home. Uh, your body is going to go through a lot more of its micronutrients because of the stress load. Uh, besides you, in the, in the middle here, you're a whole food or your multivitamin, you may not get enough of those vitamins that you need uh, through that, so you may have to supplement. On our left here, we have resveratrol. Uh, this is um, going to be 100 milligrams. You may want to uh, even double that up, uh, but that's an antioxidant. Uh, and over here on the right, we have our super stress B complex. Uh, B vitamins are very important. I would just get the whole complex. Uh, the B complex is probably the most used, our body uses the most of uh, during stress. Uh, also, vitamin C is uh, the body goes through it pretty fast when we're under stress. Also, we want to make sure we don't forget our uh, omega fatty acids. Uh, very critical for the body to function correctly and efficiently. Uh, omega-3, 6, and 9. Lots of omega-9. Omega-9 is a, one of the most potent of the anti-inflammatories of the omega family. So I hope this helps. This is just a quick uh, health tip uh, for our uh, Prepper Health Saturday. I don't typically talk a lot about supplements, but I think it is important uh, for your kits, uh, for your kits to have these supplements. You don't have to take the whole bottle, but you could just take enough for like a two or three days worth, uh, especially for your bug out bag, for example, and put them in there uh, just so you can have that so your body can actually have the ability to uh, weather stress a little better. Thanks again. Catch you soon.